checkup today and um you know he is a vegan child and she is feeding him more raw vegan every day and his checkup was perfect clearly right and um she, and you know people are always in resistance to her doing something different because down here in the deep south y'all people don't even know I told you this the other day what vegan is they think it's vegan and they don't even under they don't understand you know so and I have also noticed I was just talking to Olivia this morning about the older people are the more rigid they are in their thought process and isn't that sad like it's so much easier to work and coach with a young person to me than somebody that's in their 60s or 70s because they're so rigid because that's just that much longer that the standard you know kill you with the diet has been drilled into your brain into their brain so the quicker you can come to terms with guess what this isn't working for people and I'm gonna do something different to hello get different the sooner you can come to terms with that the better right so um, we were talking about that and and Carly, my daughter, has a lot of resistance to feeding little baby differently. Even from my mom, who clearly sees me thriving. But it's it's like an ingrained situation in their head now. But anyway, so I could just see her on the on the text. I could just visualize what she was doing, okay? And she said, um, I said, well, how did everything go? At the, she said, just got out of the checkup. I said, oh, how did everything go? And she said, clearly it was perfect BAM <laughs> but she would have done this <laughs> and she would have made that stupid move look good that I just looked ridiculous doing but the point is let other people be them you know I just this morning I was talking to somebody about that like well, what if your family's in resistance or what if you know what nobody is gonna like everything you're doing all the time that's just how it is so do your thing regardless and if they don't like it guess what talk about something else so what let them do their thing and always remember that most people come with a resistance and negativity to you changing for the better because they are not ready to change their ways they're not ready to shine the light in the dark corners of their little lives to change so they don't want to hear about animal abuse they don't want to hear about what goes on with the dairy none of this stuff because once they hear about it and they know about it 
you typically want to do something about it unless you don't want to hear it yet and then they want to darken your shine so I'm just saying do your own thing and remember to come to people in love and remember that other people are at a place that you probably were before you probably were not born into a raw vegan existence or a, a, a high raw plant-based existence you just probably weren't the odds of that I, I would love to know the statistics on that because you probably weren't so the point is you were somewhere different than you are now so remember that about people and remember that people are only receptive when they see you coming to them with a bag of love you know so may you shed your love today and um, I'm gonna get these free panties on and these are clearly a low-rise hip hugger cuties and I am very excited look free panties will drive me out to the mall that is no joke <laughs> Anyway, I just wanted to say hi and I wanted you to enjoy that song and hear the update on little baby and my daughter who, you know, even after having a baby and she, she gained about the normal amount of weight, probably 30 something pounds and little baby was a healthy size and everything and um, she lost all that weight and has been able to tone up and get back to her size, which clearly is easier the younger you are. But still, once you have a child, people can say to you, oh, it's never the same. Once you have a baby, your body will never be the same. Um, I beg to differ on that because my body never looked this good before I had children and it has everything to do with my diet and lifestyle. So, bang a gong, get it on. 